biggest moves and decisions left to be made after 2024 NFL Draft, Bleacher Report. What will Patrick Mahomes' receiving core hierarchy look like? The Chiefs managed to win a second consecutive title despite a lack of quality and depth in the receiving core last year, but it's unlikely Lightning will strike a third time if they can't get more out of that unit for Mahomes in 2024. Enter first-round pick Xavier Worthy, who has the ability to make an immediate impact as a home run hitter within that offense. The Speedy Texas product joins Marquise Brown as a newcomer within a receiver group that already included Rishi Rice, Justin Watson, Carter Ias Tony, and Sky Moore. There's a lot of skill there, but there's reason to be concerned about all of the above. This'll be a heck of a battle this spring and summer. The best value 2024 NFL draft picks for all 32 teams, including Dallas Turner and Adana Mitchell, the Athletic. Kansas City Chiefs, Xavier Worthy, W.R., Texas. With six quarterbacks going in the first 12 picks, the Chiefs were able to get quality value when they traded up in the first round to select Worthy, the fastest man in the draft, at number 28. The Chiefs love speed, and getting the Texas wide receiver late in the first round was a dream scenario for them and quarterback Patrick Mahomes. Kansas City signed veteran receiver Marquise Brown in free agency but still needed to address the position with Rishi Rice's status in doubt because of his role in a multi-vehicle crash in Dallas in March. Nate Taylor. Ranking NFL's top five offenses after 2024 draft, the 33rd team. 3. Kansas City Chiefs. The Kansas City Chiefs weathered through their toughest offensive season in the Patrick Mahomes era and still won the Super Bowl. Last year's offense was 11th in EPA per play and 8th in VOA. It was even worse through the second half of the season when it ranked 21st in EPA per play. There are plenty of questions about Kansas City's offense, but this team still has Mahomes. That's always going to quell some concerns. But there are also positive signs of improvement. After years of the low A dot, ball control passing offense on early downs, the Chiefs could be back to hunting for explosives. Kansas City signed Marquise Brown in free agency and drafted Xavier Worthy in the first round. Those two have similar skill sets, one the Chiefs haven't had since they traded Tyreek Hill. Marquez Valdez Scantling was supposed to bring a vertical element to the offense but that never panned out. During his Chiefs career, Valdez Scantling only averaged a yard per route run, with 0.86 yards per route run on the outside. Brown and were the Arfield stretchers who can open up the underneath areas for Travis Kelsey and Rishi Rice, whenever he is on the field, and convert on downfield targets.